Hey everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you are all doing well today. So it is time for another episode of our Thrifty Thursday. And this is an open collaboration hosted by Sherry over at Turquoise Dreaming. So today when I'm filming is actually March the 10th. It's on Thursday. Um, and I was off today. So I ran up to my favorite local thrift store. Uh, just to see what they had. Now, they didn't have a whole lot, but I still did get some goodies. So, we will go ahead and jump right into it. So, I got these um, Apple Apple Rolf, Apple Rolf tutoring services as SAT flashcards. Uh, it's 2011, so they're not very old, but I gave a dollar for them. And it feels like there's a good amount in here. It doesn't feel like it's full, but I didn't even open it. So, normally I open it and look inside, see how full it is before I actually buy it. But, hey, it was only a dollar, so let's see. Oh, yay. Okay. Oh, these are cool. These will look cool. Um, coffee dyed, won't they? Oh, yeah, I like these. The Ancient Art of Japanese. Let's see what's on the other side. Okay. Yeah, these will be cool. Okay, like these. Worth a dollar. Worth a dollar. It's a pretty good, pretty good stack in there. Okay, those will be fun. It'll be fun to make into journaling cards. Uh, and then I did pick up some books, guys, because their books are already super cheap, like seventy-five cents for adult hardbacks. Kids are. 50 cents maybe and something's 25 uh somewhere around in there so all their books are less 75 cents or less and they're they've been overrun with books apparently um like me um that they're having a half off sale so i mean half off 75 cents um so this is the golden treasury of uh Selsen's classics i'm not even sure what that is but guys this is uh poems a whole book of poems so I thought these were a good size too because I have come across um, collaborations and stuff here recently where they give you prompts um, and sometimes they ask for um, this right here is uh, out of um, uh, from the Bible verses from the Bible um, but yeah I thought these were really cool because they're all poems and they'll be perfect sizes to use in our journal so I picked that up sorry guys got stuff falling and my allergies are driving me nuts and it's my eyes watering and then everything looks blurry and yeah okay then I got this one. Oh, that's pretty I didn't even look at that cover either uh, so this is wildflowers of North America in full color it's not a very old book um, yeah it's got the numbers in it so I have no clue um, but it has some really pretty flower images in it now the the pages are a little bit glossy um, so I may or may not get some light clear gesso to go over it so they're not so glossy but yeah really pretty flowers in here see look at that wouldn't that make a pretty pocket or journaling card um, so yeah only thing is you know they're front and back so you would have to pick and choose but yeah pick that up half of 75 cents whatever that is 30 something cents and then this is super cute only got it because it's super cute and guys it is considered a children's book <laughs> So it was either half of a quarter or, or it was a quarter. One or the other. Uh, this one also is not very old. But I like Winnie the Pooh. Let's see, 1994. Um, but yeah, just really cute. Super thick too. Yep, love the drawings. Hold on, guys. Oh, sorry guys. Sneezy Wheezy. Ugh. And y'all don't want to hear that on camera because it is terrible. Um, okay. Oh, now my nose is itching like crazy. Okay, sorry guys. Okay, Wildflowers of South Africa. This, again, is also newer. Crack there. Um, this is... What did I decide this was? Uh, 1997, it looks like. 
Yeah, so again, not an old book, but look at these images, guys. Listen at that crackle. It sounds like no one ever even opened up this book. Look at there. Oh, aren't these gorgeous? Uh, again, the pages are a little bit glossy. Not too crazy, but... Yeah, beautiful look of there. Wow. Gorgeous, gorgeous pictures. Look at there. That's really pretty. Yeah, really pretty pictures in here. Very, very vibrant and springy and summery. So that'll be fun to play with. And then we got Rome, guys. I went out and brought home Rome. Yeah, so again, a good bit of props here lately. You need places and things like that. I mean, not that I don't have enough places on my bookshelf already, but, you know, whatever I need to tell myself to buy a new book. Uh, and again, this would have been half of 75 cents. And this is 2003. So, yeah, so not old by any means, but gosh, guys, look at these images in this book okay we don't need no naked people the images it's art guys it's art but yeah just absolutely gorgeous look at some of these images yep look at that wow yeah so that'll be fun when we need a place Fun, fun book. Uh, and then I picked this up for the weirdest reason, I guess. Well, for us, it's not weird, but some folks would think it would be weird. But this was 1970-some. Judy Levy, never heard of her patchwork pillows uh, with step-by-step -step instructions and full-size templates. And I think this one was a quarter, if I'm not mistaken. And I think this was in the 70s. Let's see if memory serves. Yeah, 1977. Um, so it goes into showing whatever all that is. Jack in the box pillow, 15 inch square. This right here is why I bought the book. This is like cardstock, and look, it's plain. And then this one, it's got your templates, plates, yeah. And then this, so this is why I got this book awesome yep can't buy this much cardstock for a quarter that's for sure yeah and it's just loaded and then you have some more of destructions or whatever all this is in the back yeah so we got that and in one of the books i think one of the uh, flower books this actually fell out so i kept it but it's just you can tell it's old um, just some paper, Western Mountain, Western Mountain Flowers, Water Lilies, Southern, um, Easter Mountain something, Violets, uh, Easter, Eastern Columbia, Lady Slippers. Yeah, it's just talking about all kinds of flowers. So someone must have really liked flowers to sit here and write all of this. Okay, it says Trillium, Wake Robin, sometimes called stink, Stinking, that's what it looks like, Willy, Stinky, Stinky Willy, Stinking Willy, is my favorite type of Trillium. It is called Stinking Willy because of its awful smell. It grows high in the Smoky Mountains and West Virginia mountains in moist places. It blooms in May and early June. The scientific name for this flower is Cherillium erectum. Another lily in the family is uh, something, can't read that, which grows in basically the same places but it's white and blooms late in May. Yellow trillium also grows in the same places. Uh, this trillium has a lemony scent. Huh. Easter columbine. 
uh, blooms at usually not to something something some of it I can't read lady slippers fire pink but yeah I thought this was interesting we almost got a blank sheet of paper lady whispers pink eastern mountains trilliums you have yellow red buff eastern columbi rockfall rock bells lady slippers violets wood lily um yeah rocky mountain colorado uh indian paintbrush yellow pink purple reds but yeah i thought that was super cool so that was in there so that'll be something to play with and lastly uh like i said there was it okay yeah, let's get up. bend over and get a hold of it about knocked my hand off before so as you can see it's a really big box it's one of the scrapbooking boxes you know back in the day things would come in open this up and try not to it's really pretty it's got lots of pink um so in here and i gave five dollars for this guys so we have a little fiskers i have to see how well it works i'm probably going to uh give this to the girls to use and then right here i'm not going to go through them all because there is a lot but i will pull them out these are all stickers guys all kinds of stickers and more and more and more stickers look stickers galore yep just all kinds of stickers so i think between us three we will have fun with these get those back down in there so yeah just all kinds of stickers fun stuff and then it looks like we have uh, more stickers over here heart they could probably trace happy birthday cupcake it looks like and then some of these little hands and little feetsies put those over there some stars more frames and then some shapes now i'm not saying i'm not going to use some of this stuff but yeah and then this is uh the fall um mat stack 100 this is from uh dc yeah wv whatever that is and these are like paper not cardstock but yeah fun stuff still look a whole pack of those then we have more shapes in here heart something for thanksgiving friends are flowers that never fade that's cute yeah so just some stuff is over here and then this looks like it came out of a um picture album so we have that there and then and then she says we lift this up oh that kept happening earlier and you lift up this little tray guys and then we have some few more stickers in here lots of really cute stickers look at those aren't those just darling and then those there's a harvest one I guess all of those would be springy a kind word is like a spring day oh that's sweet and then this is just must have been what comes in it came in it more stickers alphabet stickers and then we have cardstock and I'm gonna assume this white cardstock is um, stamp it up because that's what the other is just two pieces of that this is stamp it up and this is chocolate chip color so that would be really pretty for fall and then we have purple and well it says lavender so they're both um the 12 by 12 yeah so that was fun for five dollars that will give um the girls something yeah it doesn't go that way Lori. put it the way it goes something really cute to play in it doesn't really sit in there like it's supposed to there it goes so yeah so that is oh let's put their little thingy back in there um five dollars pretty good for five dollars so i will be putting that up 
minus a couple of stickers for the girls to play with. Yeah, so that is our um, Thrifty Thursday for today. Again, that is an open collaboration hosted by Sherry over at Turquoise Stream. And I really like these. I may go ahead and coffee dial and get that started. Um, turquoise streaming uh, I will make sure that her um, link to her YouTube channel is in the description box below you guys go over there and check her out you can jump in and out of this collaboration anytime you like just make sure to go over there and let her know you're going to participate thank you guys so much for your support I really do appreciate it I love you guys and we'll see you next time bye bye